So that was the business running now for about 10 years. And for four years of that, it was just an uphill struggle, a complete uphill struggle. We then got a knock to 2018 and I said, I'd never, ever do domestic loading work again. It took two years to get that sorted out. And then at the end of all of that, I eventually did take on an extension. I made some decent money out of it. It wasn't great. And I said, well, if I'm going to go back to doing this, then I'm going to do it properly and get sorted. 2002, we did 150 grand. Greg set as a, laid down a goal that had said, can you do 500? Set as a target for 500,000. We smashed that and did 635 grand in turnover, not profit. Uh, and then this year, so far, I think we're on for just shy of a million. It's sort of just been organic. So as far as sort of lead generation, uh, that's been the major catalyst, really. I mean, the lead generation has been phenomenal. But, and it is a matter of turning it on and off. You. I can go from one week where we've got no jobs to look at because I'm too busy and I can turn it on next week and have anything from five to 10 jobs to look at in a week. So that's a, a major help. Also sort of this year, we're concentrating a lot more on sort of building out systems and everything's running smoothly because the one thing that I don't think many people anticipate is having a problem that they've grown too much too quickly. And that, is, that has been the problem. Well, we've got every Monday morning an opportunity to get on a on a video, and and even if you're not talking, even if you're just doing your own work while you know listening into what other people are saying, you're you're finding that the same problems are happening at all different levels. Whether uh, it's people running plus five million pound companies, or whether or not it's people running five hundred thousand pound companies, they've all got the same problems. Um, Usually the bigger companies, they've kind of got better ways of dealing with it, probably because they've been around a lot longer, uh, but also because they've probably had a lot more tuition, probably by trying to sort that with them things out. And so, yeah. I'd say for what it costs to be part of the mastermind is a fraction of what you're actually going to get out of it. So if you're serious about building a business, just do it because it's true. You're not going to do it on your own, not unless you've got parents who are businessmen and they can point you in the right direction or some family member. It's not going to happen. It's, it's just not. There's no amount of books. And the other part of the problem is, even if they are, they're not in construction most likely. And construction has got its own specific set of problems that you are not going to find in shopkeeping or anything else.